Why hello everybody, I'm your not so humble host, Amazing Red Zero Nine here, with a new episode of Let's Play Assassin's Creed. In the last episode, we went to Akka and took care of our second target, I believe. Yes, it was our second target. In this episode, I have travelled to Um Jerusalem to get to our third target. Let's get on with it. a big line. Just jog down here. Just mow down all these poor people. There we go. It's a nice little view of Jerusalem. Back then this looked really really good. Even though I didn't actually get this when it came out. Okay. Let's just Jump off our horse. See you later, Agro. If anyone gets that reference, I will love you forever. I'm sure a lot of people do, considering it's quite a popular game. We just want to run up here. I said we just want to run up here. Oh, that was such a fail. Let's hope there's going to be a little less. Hopefully, there'll be a little less, little less failure in this one, but not so little that you guys won't find it entertaining. All, the, all ten of you. Um, <laughs> Seriously guys, if there's anything I can do to make my episodes more entertaining, please let me know. We should say this at the end, but I'm going to say it now because I'll forget otherwise. Um, just let me know if there's anything I can do to make my episodes more entertaining. Or if something I am doing that you want me to continue doing, then I'll keep doing it. Okay, we're in, we're in Jerusalem. We just wanted to um, do what we did normally with the last, with Akka. We just want to... Um, there's an interrogation mission there, but first of all, let's go get this uh, viewpoint. Like I said, if there's anything I can do, please let me know. So I'm quite new at this, so I don't know what works and what does not. Bloody archers are looking at me. Go away. Any man willing to work can have his due. Come, speak with me. Let me tell you what Okay, this way. So just let me know if there's anything I can do to make the experience of my Let's Plays more enjoyable. Or anything you want me to stop doing, then just tell me and I'll do it. I'll at least take it under advisement. Super nice. Mmm, pretty. Checking I'm still recording, and yes, I am. Good. Okay, there is an interrogation machine down there. Since this is right here, let's do this. Since it's right here. Small sacrifice for great rewards. Who Look knows on what the future holds? What tragedies tomorrow may bring? Defend against an uncertain future. Protect the ones you love. Work hard, and you will be rewarded. Talal provides. I'm gonna fuck you up. So it's basically just as usual. Just follow him until he's in a nicely secluded place, and then fuck him up. Simple as that. Don't get too close or get suspicious and run away. It is, that's how I remember it. It's a bit dark, but there are people here. I think this is the place you want to go. You'll turn in a minute. No, get down. Go the outside here. Get up. I think you'll turn left here. If I remember right. I do remember right, good. Let's fuck him up. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Not him. Ow, fucking hell. Getting fucked up by a peasant. I have nothing to say to you. Oh, what? You can create diversions with dead bodies. Soldiers will. Oh, come on, game! Talal understands your pain. What that was bullshit. Um, well, at least it showed us something. Uh, if you kill civilians, then you lose synchronization. In other words, you'll lose health. 
which I think is really fucking stupid, but whatever. Protect the ones you love. Work hard, and you will be rewarded. Talal provides. Punching them doesn't count as killing them. Then, because I chucked him into a wall, it counted as murdering him. Blah blah, fucking blah. Work hard, and you will be rewarded. Talal provides. Yeah, we get it. Come on. Fuck you up, man. Fuck you up. Make room. Just own him now. Go away. There you go, done. I have nothing to say to you. Speak to me or speak to God. It's your choice. You won't stop the work he does. Cannot stop it. Stop what? What work? He prepares them for the journey. Journey where? They are held in his warehouse. And when the time comes, Hello, they are sent to Akka. Where is this warehouse? And why Akka? <laughs> Talal tells me what I need to know. <laughs> more. It is safer that uh. way. For him, perhaps. Though not, I fear, for you. Shanked, and let's. Whoops, sorry about that, not the mic. Still recording, yes. Let's get out of here before the guards realise that I just murdered that guy. Okay. Now let's head to the bureau. Bloody itch right next to the mic, I would, wouldn't I? Where is he? The um, furry knives are one hit kills, which is awesome. And I believe that they're infinite supply, which is pretty, pretty badass. The one hit kill for any enemy, the archers, is very handy for, against the archers. Because they spot you, just chuck a ooh, ooh, flag. Um, they just, uh, you just chuck a throwing knife at them and they will die in one shot, which is really awesome. So if you get spotted by an archer, like this guy here, just chuck a knife at him, and he's dead. So, simple. And someone's getting owned downstairs again. I really boy downstairs. I mean, on the street, not in my house. Um, yeah, so they're very handy against archers, and I recommend that you use them. That's the only thing they're good for, really, is taking out archers when you're trying to go across the roofs, the roofs. And me and my rummy. Uh, Okay, let's just move on. Let's just pretend that didn't happen. Pretend I didn't just fail immensely. Okay, Assassin's Bureau. Itch, itch, itch. <laughs> I would have an itch right next to the microphone, wouldn't I? Cutscene! Safety and peace, Malik. Your presence here deprives me of both. What do you want? Al Muallam has asked. Asked that you perform some menial task in an effort to redeem yourself. Yep. So be out with it. Tell me what you can about the one they call Talal. It is your duty to locate and assassinate the man, Altair, not mine. You'd do well to assist me. His death benefits the entire land. Do you deny his death benefits you as well? Such things do not concern you. Your actions very much concern me. Then don't help me. I'll find him myself. <sighs> wait, wait. It won't do having you stumble about the city like a blind man. Better you know where to begin your search. I'm listening. I can think of three places. South of here in the markets that line the border between the Muslim and Jewish districts. To the north near the mosque of this district, and east in front of St. Anne's Church. Close to the Babariha Gate. Is that everything? It's enough to get you started, and more than you deserve. So yeah, a lot of the others, you can't really help us, I mean... He would give us a hand, but you know he's only got one. Ha ha ha! God, I'm sorry. That was terrible. And very in bad size considering I did that. Technically. Okay. Head to the nearest viewpoint. So we can find some more missions to do. Yes, I know how to use very nice. I've been using them since the start. And they're not even in infinite supply. Huh. What the work? The way it's explained in this way, it's already explained it, like at the start of the game. In the tutorial mission. This isn't the tutorial, this is the third mission. For God's sake. Just keep climbing. 
one of the most annoying things about this game is the fucking archers. For obvious reasons, they are admittedly suspicious of a man climbing the walls, but it's still annoying. And I'm not sure, but I think they fixed that in the next game. There, I can't talk. I believe they fixed that in the next game. But I cannot really be sure because it's been quite a while since I've played the second game. Synchronize. Alright, there's a pickpocket mission over there. Let's go do that. How many missions do I need to do? Need to two. Okay. It's good. I don't. I'm not sure, but I know I said last time that eventually they make you do all of them, but I'm not really sure if that's true or not. But I guess we'll be finding out, won't we? What did he do? Oh, it's it's a. Oh, get off me, you turd! Yeah, I <laughs> ran into a Templar. If yeah, they see you, they will assume you're violent towards them immediately, sir. Which is stupid. Um, go okay, oh, far right, use the ladder. Um, not gonna say, what did they do there? But no, the uh, Templars are immediately hostile to you. Which is really fucking stupid, but that's, that's life, I guess. Let's do this pickpocket mission. I like this because they're fucking easy to do. I don't that take that, well, that much time. If there weren't so many of these missions, like if they actually, you know, had different variety, then this wouldn't be so bad. But it is. If so. the guard won't take action, it falls to us to do something. What you propose is madness, but necessary. How madness? many more will we allow to go missing before the people take a stand? It does not affect us. Not yet. But if we continue to do nothing, it will. And what do you propose? I've watched the man. Learned everything there is to know about his operation. It's all here on a map I've made. He inspects his stock every day at the same time. This is when I'll strike. So you have a piece of paper. It won't save you when you're discovered. Won't shield you from their swords and arrows. If all goes well, it won't come to that. Anyway. He will. It's a risk I'll have to take. I guarantee it. Wish me luck, my friend. Indeed. You'll need it. Especially since I'm about to steal all those. Do this. Wait for him to turn. Go in direction he's gonna go. And done. Watch his watch his um Yeah. <laughs> and okay. Okay now we uh, investigation is done in a lot quick a lot is better time than last time. Um oh, for God's sake. <laughs> uh oh, oh glitch. Uh okay. Sorry. Um, what's so fucking itchy today? Oh, you don't care, and that's kind of gross, sir. I can't remember. Where do you get pro knives? Do you like find them on. Can you. You know, um. No? Alright. Where do you find them? I guess. Do you not have them? I don't know. I'm mumbling, so I better stop talking. Stop talking? No! Can't stop talking, it's a let's play. It's the idea of a let's play. And I'm rambling now because I've got nothing to talk about. We needed to, to the bureau, and it, this one's only done, which is quite a, quite a short one. I think it's just because I, um, done it, did it quite quickly. Cutscene! Malik. Come to waste more of my time? I found Talal. I'm ready to begin my mission. That is for me to decide. Very well. Here's what I know. He traffics in human lives, kidnapping human Muslim there? citizens and selling them into slavery. His base is a warehouse located inside the Barbican, north of here. As we speak, he prepares a caravan for travel. I'll strike while he's inspecting his stock. If I can avoid his men, Talal himself should prove little challenge. Little challenge? Listen to you. Such arrogance. Are we finished? Are you satisfied with what I've learned? No. But it will have to do. Is LT phasing through the floor a little? Rest, prepare, cry in the corner. Do whatever it is you do before a mission. Stop make sure you do it quietly. <laughs> that was kind of weird. Uh -oh. Fast forward. 
reverting memory to a more recent one. Ubisoft couldn't be bothered to animate a sleeping animation. Okay, let's go. But those who want to know, those little things in like, I'm facing now, those icons, they're the uh, civilians. So the only reason, there's no real reason to do that. There's, there's no, you don't get XP in this game, so there's no reason to have those. Have it for that. I guess, I guess they get refilled over, over like um. Every time I go to the bureau or something, I don't know. It's been a long time since I've played this game, a couple of years, so. I'm only let's play this because it's one of my favourite games ever. Can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? Yep, good. Flag. Like I said before, this is not 100% walkthrough, so I will not be getting all of them. And this isn't a walkthrough either, is it, so. Let's play, you. You're supposed to um, be here for me, not for the game. Ah, oh, bollocks. Ah! Ow! Bitch! <laughs> Bitch! Okay. It was... Yeah. Just, uh... Oh, that was bullshit. That sh that shouldn't have hurt me. Yeah, this one's full of fucking loads of different bugs. So, unfortunately, I, like I said, I know I complain a bit about this. You gotta be joking. Uh, so I know I complain a little about this game, but it is a good game. It's just got a lot of problems. Oh, you gotta be joking! What have I done? Why are they hostile to me? I've done nothing. Why are they hostile to me? I have done nothing wrong. Maybe you should. Oh, this is going quite well actually, until then. Oh yeah, because that would have totally hurt. Oh, I remember now! I remember how you get... I remember how you get knives. See this guy over here? Watch. Oh, for God's sake, come here. Fuck this, I'm out of here. Uh, I so say you can pickpocket those um, mercenaries and they have knives on them, so. Oh, come on, clock. Oh, come on, it's right there! See what I mean? This game has a lot of problems, but it's a good game. So don't, don't, don't mind my complete complaining all the time. Excuse me, sir. I actually thought I had my hidden blade out, but it doesn't matter now. It certainly isn't the guy swinging on the roost. I just go run away. How long have we been recording for? Okay. This was going so well. Got to go in that building. Yes, I did. Go away. Ow. Yeah, those guys I think are meant to be um, mentally challenged or whatever the fuck the word is. Um, whatever the political correct word is. Oh, it's a trap. I'm so shocked. Um, so whatever the politically correct word is. I pause it so I can talk. Um, whatever the, the politically correct word is for someone who's got mental problems. And they will just hit you for their reason. So. They don't cause any damage though, which is good. What now, slaver? Do not call me that. As I myself was held. You do no kindness imprisoning them like this. Imprisoning them? 
I keep them safe, preparing them for the journey that lies ahead. What journey? It is a life of servitude. <laughs> you know nothing. It was folly to even bring you here. To think that you might see and understand. I understand well enough. Show yourself. Hmm. Okay, let's go. Help me. Save me. No thanks. Yeah, Alti is a douche. I won't even try and help people. Ah, so you want to see the man who called you here? You did not call me here. I came on my own. Did you? Who unbarred the door? Cleared the path? Did you once raise your blade against a single man of mine, huh? No. All this I did for you. Step into the light then. I will grant you one final favor. Please tell me you didn't. Please tell me you saw this coming. Now I stand before you. What is it you desire? Come down here. Let us settle this with honor. Why must it always come to violence? It seems I cannot help you. For you do not wish to help yourself. And I cannot allow my work to be threatened. You leave me no choice. You must die. Okay, bring it. This Ow. Ow. I'm not great at this game. Well, I am no I am at least decent at this game normally. Ow. Ow. Ow, my balls. Dead. Next. Who's next? Come on. The taunt hit them. Just spam the counter button. Yeah, the combat's piss easy in this game. It doesn't change for the entire series. Except we get more tough, a lot tougher enemies. I hate it when they fake you out. Die! Thank you. Oh, get off me, you turd. And I hate when they actually grab you and all. It's really fucking annoying. I'm not normally this bad. Oh, the cat may fuck it. This is normally over pretty quickly, but it's because I'm got the let's let's play curse at its finest. I have to think the combat gets easier as the game goes as the uh, series goes on. Chase him, and now we gotta chase him. Keep him away from him. Chasey, chase, chasey, chase, chase. Climb, thank you. Got you, little turd. Didn't go for it. Didn't, to run now. didn't get far, did Share it? Your secrets with me. My part is played. The Brotherhood is not so weak that my death will stop its work. What Brotherhood? Al Mualim is not the only one with the Brotherhood of Steel. Oh, for that reference. And that's all you'll have from me. Don't even like Fulham. We are finished. Beg forgiveness from your God. He's long abandoned us. Long abandoned the men and women I took into my arms. What do you mean? Beggars, whores, addicts, lepers. Do they strike you as proper slaves? Unfit for even the most menial tasks? 
No. I took them not to sell, but to save. And yet you'd kill us all. For no other reason than it was asked of you. No. You profit from the war. From lives lost and broken. Yes. You would think that, ignorant as you are. Wall off your mind, eh? They say it's what your kind do best. Do you see the irony in all this? No. Not yet, it seems. But you will. Okay. Let me to run. Ow. That hurt. Quite a lot. So, get the fuck away from here. No, no, don't fall down there. Fucking game. Screw you! Ow! Climb, 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 climb. There's like eight guards following me. Get out of the way! Oh, really, game? Oh, there's also a Templar following me. It's never good. Ugh. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> God, I'm so terrible! Don't you devil! Oh, I'm getting angry at this game. Especially when you pull. Really, game? Oh, God. Oh, God. Climb faster. Get out of the way! Get out of my way! Why am I still running? I'd normally be able to get rid of him by now. Whee! Run away, run away, run away! Come on. Go oh, fuck off! That was bullshit. Go! There we go. Oh, that was stupid. Okay. Send back to the Bureau as soon as we're not so suspicious anymore. Okay, we're not anymore. Days, however. Oh, it's not. Okay. Head back to the pure. Sorry, what? What? What happened there? I just suddenly became like everyone was staring at me again. What the fuck, game? Give me a minute. Okay. We're well, just gonna get attacked again. No, good. Let's grab this um, flag. Oh, come the fuck on, game. Oh. oh, come on. Get out of my way. Come on, faster. Uh, uh, there's one up there. Okay, go. Climb, damn you. Oh, this is ridiculous now. <laughs> Stab him while I'm out. <sighs> well, those, those blue dots on your map are places you can hide. They only come up when you're being chased. I'm not going to grab anything, am I? Nope, I nearly died. Great. Seriously, this game's such a dickhead sometimes. Uh, the blue stuff is an example of um, places you can't go yet. It's basically the game telling you that you're not that part of the game yet. So. Oh, 
It means he wasn't there at this point in his memory. Jump! Jump! Oh, come on, game. This is ridiculous. Oh, come on. On a bet. Yes. Ah, oh, this is hell. Okay. Oh, uh, let's play curse at its finest. At least that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. And I made that joke last time. I'm gonna go away. <sighs> okay, let's go. Stick to the rooftops. That's annoying. Seriously, I hate this bit. This bit can be really fucking annoying. No. Can I get spotted? I'm right near the Brira. Okay. Another file of episode. Here. Yeah. Cutscene. Wonderful to see you return to us. And how fared the mission? The deed is done. Talal is dead. Oh, I know, I know. In fact, the entire city knows! Have you forgotten the meaning of subtlety? A skilled assassin ensures his work is noticed by the many. No! A skilled assassin maintains control of his environment. <laughs> we can argue the details all you'd like, Malik. But the fact remains I've accomplished the task set to me by Al Muallim. Go then. Return to the old man. Let us see with whom he sides. You and I are on the same side, Malik. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. It's arguable. And I'll just fire through that wall a little. Yay! <laughs> I believe they're going to take us out of the Animus now. If I remember correctly. Yep. Damn it! What's the problem now? I'm getting weird temperature readings. I think the animus is overheating. Christ! It's always something! How long? Too soon to tell. <laughs> These delays are Excuse unacceptable, Miss Stillman. I want progress reports every hour. It's gonna be a while, Desmond. Why don't you go lie down or something? Get some rest. Want to come with me? <laughs> okay. We should talk to talk to. Why is he always yelling at you? Yep. It's his machine. His theories. He's not the one who built it. Who did? You? <laughs> no. Abstergo has a team of engineers. Not much they don't have. But I did oversee the assembly. Guess that's why he gets so angry with me. He's a dick. He's under a lot of pressure. Yep. We all are. Can't believe you're defending the guy. <coughs> Excuse me. Life. So if he wants to yell a little, let him. What do you mean he saved your life? You're not the only one who doesn't get to go home at night. Wait, are you saying you're a prisoner? When they first approached me, I was finishing up my PhD. The university had made it clear I had no future there. They didn't like the subject of my doctorate, called it pseudoscience. Said keeping me on would discredit and embarrass them. It was the same everywhere. Other universities, companies I interviewed with. Pretty soon I was out of money and out of time. I was this close to waiting tables. Then I got a letter. From Vidic? He said he'd been following my career since undergrad, that he believed in my work and wanted to meet to discuss my future. You have no idea how good it felt to hear that. So I met with him. What did I have to lose? And he offered you a job? Yes, here at Abstergo, helping out on the Animus Project. I'd have a chance to test my theories and prove the professors wrong. How could I turn that down? 
think I'm missing the part where you became a prisoner. Sometimes I wonder if they weren't behind it all. If they manipulated events so that I'd get desperate. They can do that. They can do anything. I didn't think when I agreed to come here. They even told me I'd be trapped. For six months, a year max. Once the product launched, there'd be no need for secrecy anymore. But until then, I'd be a guest of the company. At least, that's what they said. And when the Animus was ready? They came in while I was sleeping. Three guys. Guns. They dragged me out of bed. God. The worst part is I knew them. One guy, Richard, we ate lunch together sometimes. And now he was gonna... They were cracking jokes. I tried to pull away. He hit me. And that's when he told me I was going to die. Christ, what did you Nothing. do? Nothing. I kept telling myself it wasn't real. And then Warren was there, shouting at them to get away from me. And they listened. Jesus. I'm watching you. He's not a happy man, Desmond. I wouldn't even say he's a good man, but he saved my life. They never came for me again. And he promised they never would. You're still stuck here working for these nut jobs. But I'm alive. Anyway, I really do need to get the animus repaired. I'll see you tomorrow, Desmond. Are we done? Yes. Yeah, when you talk, if you want to get all the um, conversations, look what I'm doing, then that will open when there's none left. Um, yeah. Okay. So let's take a sleep and they're not in the set. So the reason I want to get all the um, conversations is because it reveals more of the story. And that's about it. Whereas the... the um, Someone's been in here. Look close. Looks like some kind of access code. Ah. Could it be for this door? Let's find out. It is! It's for this door. Now, we can now go in and out of that room at any time we want. Now, we could also go over here and use the Animus any time we want. So you want to relive memories and it's very handy at um, post game. But we'll get to that when we get to that. Let's take a nap, shall we? So the only reason I'm talking to Lucy is because it reveals the plot. Rise and shine. We've got quite a day ahead of us. You're in a good mood this morning. Miss Stillman has made some modifications to the Animus. You should be able to remain inside even longer now. And help you with your treasure hunt. This is serious business, Mr. Miles. I don't think you fully appreciate the work that Abstergo does. Maybe because I don't actually know what you people do. We change the world. Every day, in a hundred different ways. Did you know that nearly every single breakthrough of the past millennia, be it medical, mechanical, or philosophical, has come from Abstergo or its predecessors? No, because that's a lie. Claim, Doc. Think you might be exaggerating a bit? Not in the slightest. Oh, we certainly don't take the credit. That would arouse far too much suspicion. We choose our beneficiaries with great care. It's a very hot Why? coffee, isn't it? Isn't it obvious? It means we're in control. But how? What makes you guys so special, so smart, that you happen to invent all these things while us mere mortals stumble around like idiots? To be fair, we don't invent them. We find them. Find them? They're gifts, Mr. Miles. From those who came before. We'll have to continue this discussion later. Time's wasting. Okay. To quote Halloween, 4545. Cryptic bullshit! Okay, now I've blatantly stole a line from another Let's Player, one who's much more popular and pretty much 
much, 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 much better than I am. Next time on Let's Play Assassin's Creed, we will... Do you just need to fall asleep? Anyway, next time on Let's Play Assassin's Creed, we will go back in the Animus and continue our mission to take down all of the names of our assassin assassination targets. See you next time.